Let's start without any delay. Press Windows and X key together to open options. Then click on Search. Now type TSKMGR in the search bar and open Task Manager from the list. You can right-click on it and run it as an administrator. Now pay attention, for some user Task Manager can open in a quick mode, so if this is the case then you need to click See Details link to open it in a regular mode. Now click on File menu and select Run New Task. Then we need to select a file so click on the Browse button. Just follow my screen. Open C Drive. Move to this folder. Then try to find a file with name CMD here, right. Select it and click Open. Now pay attention at this point. Now we have to run this task as an administrator writes. So make sure you check this box. And then click OK. Now a command prompt will open up. Type this command, which is GP update. This will take a few seconds to complete. You can pause the screen till then. Now since it is executed, just type CLS. And the next command would be chkdsk with the parameter of our OS installation drive. In my case it is C drive, just cross verify the results with my screen. Make sure it is executed well. Now, type exit and close all the windows before we proceed to next step. Click on search. Then type device manager in the search box. Open device manager from the list. Then expand Display Adapters drop-down. Open your Display Adapter from the list. Right-click on it and select Update. Then choose Browse My Computer option. Now, select Let Me Pick option below. Then click on either option, and then click Next. You can redo the step, and choose second one, if this does not work. And this will install the drive. If you are blocked at this stage, then I am leaving a link to download a driver manually for your computer, follow that and resume back from this step. Click on search. And open device manager again. Now this time, double click on your adapter. Now, go to driver tab. You need to click on roll back button, in my case it is not showing. Now next step is very important. Click on search icon. Type CMD. From the search results. Right click on it. And select run as administrator. This commands are very important to fix this problem. To avoid mistakes. You will get all commands in description below. Copy them and simply right click on CMD to paste it. And hit enter to execute them for each command. At the last, type SFC SAP slash scan now and hit enter. It will take some time to complete its process. Wait for it and finally restart your system. That's it guys. Your problem is solved.